Well, it might seem like we're running short on good beach days this summer, but how does it compare with previous years? TV6 meteorologist Sean Householder has the story up close. It seems Mother Nature is up to her old tricks again this summer. If you're a beach bum, it might seem like those nice days haven't been piling up like they should. In some days, it seems like local lifeguards are spending more time trying to keep warm than anything else. Yeah, I would say about half of the summer we've, we've closed. So just due to like either really cold days, like when it's been like low 50s or just when it's raining like this. But while areas near Lake Superior have been cool, most of the inland locations have actually managed more ideal weather. The official statistics might be deceiving. Average temperatures during both May and June actually landed slightly above normal. That's because we had a handful of unusually warm days to balance out all those cool ones. July finished up more than three and a half degrees below average, which it turns out is among the top 10 coldest Julys on record for many places in Upper Michigan. But compared to most of the rest of the country, Upper Michigan has sailed by with more or less benign weather. We're not hurting for rain. In fact, we're running with more than a three inch rainfall surplus on the year. And we've only had a handful of severe weather days. It's been very quiet up here and, and most of that has been attributed to cooler temperatures. We haven't had as much instability in the environment to get stronger storms going. That does leave us wondering, <laughs> what will the dog days of summer have in store? Uh, August is always a tricky month because we're not quite into the transition season into fall yet, so we still have a lot of summer uh, left through the month of August. And, you know, right now it looks like pretty close to average, maybe just a slight chance below average. Meantime, local lifeguards continue standing guard just in case you do get the courage to actually visit the beach. On days like this, we'll probably wait and like, we'll probably close around two, three at the latest, but yeah. Otherwise, um, we're still open for the majority of the day. Probably hoping we do close early, but we don't. <laughs> Reporting in Marquette, Sean Householder, TV6 News.